hi guys welcome to my channel today uh, we'll discuss on the confirmation production order confirmation uh, screen layout so <clears throat> when you do the production order confirmation at operation level generally we use the uh, transaction code CO11N so if I go to it's in co 11 n so there are different uh, parameters are there like in header confirmation order number operation okay <coughs> work center and then quantity activity personal details dates okay so these are the uh, uh, and this is the some kind of text if you want to enter during uh, 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 confirmation so this layout, this is the layout being uh, configured in the system and we can make our own layout for this uh, confirmation screen. Okay. So let me go through uh, that configuration parameter, how we can change the layout and what are the parameters are there to, uh, update, uh, to uh, modify the, to prepare our own layout okay so let me go to spro <coughs> so in spro production subfloor control operation and confirmation in confirmation single screen entry and define uh, define single screen entry for confirming product order okay so here if you look now this SAP 001 is one of the confirmation profile being uh, assigned to the system. So this is made as a standard profile. So when you op open the CO11, so whatever uh, parameter has set in this in this profile that we are able to see in the CO11. Okay, and let me go go to the details of this profile. So this is the description. Okay. Now header area. If you look at header area, here what is the confirmation number, order number, sequence, operation number, work center. If I drop down this one, see we have the lot of uh, header area. Like suppose you don't want the order number sequence, so they can use the confirmation only. And then uh, like confirmation order sequence of sub operation you want sub operation number also you can choose this one if you don't want to work center then this one sequence operation sub operation so there are different uh, headers are there so based on your requirement you can choose either of header okay then area so in our uh, details of area first quantity so in quantity like uh, suppose yield so yield scrap rework region again yield scrap region so different uh, area uh, parameters are there Com combination of different parameters are there so we can choose the as per our requirement again activity activity one is activity one to so activity six activity 1 to 6 and some kind of table control and some business process activity 6 plus some if any additional business process that is there okay and if only business there is no active only business process that is there okay then personal number suppose who the user who is confirming products confirming the production so that personal number if you want to track that personal number here you can give the personal number 
space per person number, time ID number, again uh, if you want to add the work center, wage group. So, okay. so these are about personal details. Then debt, debt like uh, execution, forecast debt. Okay. Then additional debts. We want to uh, posting debt, break time, all those they are in the additional debt. Okay. Then forecast. Forecast means like what are the forecast value of other material. So that if you want to track that uh, forecast value, that here it will give one space. So that can be used to update that forecast quantity. External ID. If you want any uh, suppose you uh, production order is being confirming from the, your any interface any uh, third party interface and that coming to your system and in third party uh, interface since when someone is confirming they might be used some external UD uh, external ID that is not the your SAP user ID that might be the external uh, ID so that can be updated in this field okay some text for some text you can uh, use confirmation this is for long text this is for short text suppose if you want to create the quality notification so there is one option to come if you choose this one quality notification and uh, if you want to track the serial number that also you can give the serial number assignment there you can put all these your material or component what is the serial number okay and all these are the additional fields are there like custom if you want some custom field then these are the additional fields are there okay so the all these are like additional fields and this is for shift suppose you want to put the shift that you can put the shift okay so these are the different if you look at in this profile this is the standard profile there we have made quantity, activity, personal details, dates, additional data, and confirmation text. Okay. Now I'll show you to create a new profile. Okay. So based on now because we made it as a standard SAP001, we made it as a standard profile. So these parameters are coming in the CO11. Like if this is a header quantity quantity activity activity and here personal details personal details okay dates here also coming uh, dates okay and here supplement so if you look at additional data supplement additional information for additional information okay and here long text so here long text so as per this profile layout it is coming this one so if you look at this is chosen as standard profile so uh, this layout it's when you open c11 this layout is coming okay so suppose let me show you how to create uh, a new profile SPRO and then production and then uh, support control operation and then confirmation and single screen entry okay here this one okay now suppose uh, it's better to copy this one and then we'll adjust the profile in that okay let me copy this one we'll copy standard one here we'll give it our own uh, profile na name suppose i will give two okay okay 
so now here here suppose first header header now it is chosen order sequence operation works and okay suppose we don't want the sequence so if uh, I, I think sequence is every everywhere okay so operation suppose we don't want to work center okay we want only operation sub sub operation okay i let me choose this one okay then uh, here it is uh, for quantity uh, yield scrap rework region so suppose i choose only yield scrap region so this one and then activity suppose i choose this one one to six table control okay and uh, i'll add some additional here okay uh, suppose i add serial number assignment okay i'll put here as a serial number okay so and uh, here if you click this one you can see what are the details in, in this serial number assignment area what are the fields are there look at see if you choose this one you will get this this type of uh, uh, layout material number and serial material number means your parent matrix and it what is it, it's that is serial number and if your component of serial number you can maintain all the component and what are the serial numbers okay and then here uh, suppose i will choose current notification quality notification okay so teach now i choose all this uh, parameter okay and if you look at it is closed closed one column box is there closed so closed means suppose I have like it is like uh, details are there. If I closed, if I put it closed. Then when you open the screen, it will be in closed status. You have to expand that one. Okay, I'll show you there. Okay, suppose for example, I made it as closed, and I will make quantity also as closed. Okay, now I'll save it. I saved it. And so now here now SAP zero zero one standard profile. I'll remove that uh, tick and I'll make the new profile as a standard profile. What we created G S A P zero zero two. I made it as the uh, one of the uh, standard profile. Okay. I'll save it. Save it. Okay. Now I'll go to the CO11. See, header is confirmation, order, operation, sub operation, and sequence. Uh, if you look at the Reno work center, because we what we chosen, I'll go to that profile again. Look at here confirmation order sequence operation sub operation you do not have the you do not have the work center so that work center is not there okay and if you look quantity i made it as closed so if you look at this is not an expandable form if you want i can expand this one okay so if you put the closed then when you open the screen it remain the non expandable uh, uh, non expandable form then you have to expand that one so that you will get all these fields okay so here you will put a scrap okay. 
now uh, here activity so what activity what i choose we choose activity 1 to 6 and table control so this is the activity and this is one kind of table okay similarly personal details so here is personal details personal work center waste group waste type okay and then dates so here after that uh, dates so here if you look at date start date finish date forecast indicator date then uh, supplement here is your supplement posting date break time then long text here is a long text okay now serial number see serial number also i put as closed so it is in non-expandable form i will expand i need to expand that okay. so if i expand see it is showing all the serialized assembly so if you are your parent material you can give the uh, material number serial number and components material and serial number okay after that quality notification okay so here we can create the uh, quality notification okay and here assign change but here we can create the notification so uh, suppose uh, actually this is not the system is not activated for the notification so suppose all these need details to be add okay so then you can create the notification here and you can uh, put the you can change this one so this is uh, all about the layout uh, how to change the layout of uh, uh, layout of the confirmation single screen confirmation entry okay when you do the time uh, time confirmation that layout can be changed for this profile by creating the new profile okay